Hi everyone, welcome to my channel. If your dream is to become a data analyst or a data scientist, then cracking the SQL interview is a very important stage for attaining your dream. Myself, MLV Prasad, I'm a mentor for data science and analytics in a, at a reputed company. I can help you overcome this obstacle by explaining all the various questions asked in top companies which are already available at the LeetCode platform. All my code solutions for all the questions which are available in lead code are available in my github repository which the link for that is given in the chat description below. In addition to that I have also segregated my all the videos which are available in the channel into 5 different playlists which are namely hardness level categorized like easy medium hard only the premium level questions of lead code and all the 230 questions in a serialized ordered playlist. Let's see the question which we are trying to solve today. It is of type medium, question number 01784, department highest salary. Okay, let's see the question. Okay, it is also asked in Amazon, Google and Microsoft for entry level interviews. Let's see what are the tables which they are given. They are given employee which is consisting the details, ID, name, salary, department and ID is the unique column for this table. Okay, And they have given one more table department. Well, it will describe whether the employees belonging to which category means which department. And here ID is the primary game. No, okay, for, got it. Now what they are asking is find employees who have the highest salary in each department. Okay. Okay, let's see table and understand it. Let's take the department table. Okay, let's see. This employee table is connected to department table. One minute. Using ID and ID. Okay. I'm sorry, department ID. It is not. ID is the employee name. Department ID of employee will describe which department they are. Okay. One belongs to IT. Two belongs to IT. Two belongs to sale. 2 belongs to sale, 1 belongs to IT. Okay. So, what are the sales which are available in 2, 80,000, and 60,000? So, if you can see from sales, 80,000 is the highest thing. Right? Similarly, for IT, there are 70,000, 90,000, 90,000, and 90,000. You can see there is 90,000 is the highest, and there are two things. This one, and this one right so that is why they are given sales IT and IT with two people so it is very simple what we will be doing here let's join these two tables using inner join you can then the matching table department will be there only matching things are required so I'm keeping inner join after that we can rank their salary with respect to department. We can partition by department and we can order by salary and we can give rank of them. Okay. Then what we can do for each department, we will be taking rank equal to one, which is the highest. Let's code it down. Okay. Let's write it from employee A and join. Department B Department 
department ID so it should not be department it should be department equal to B dot ID okay we have joined them now what we want select we need ID row name row there are two IDs so I will call it as a dot ID as a ID name column salary column department ID and also department ID comma BID as PID comma there is one more name okay let's call it a dot name a dot name as a n and uh, b dot name as p n okay let's create a ranking for each thing we will do being what rank where we want for each group we want which each department so I'll partition by department and the order should be what salary high to salary low so I'll keep salary descending order by let's call it as RK okay let's run it okay if you see this okay if you see this all the matching row columns are given and also the ranks are there but what we want here only for rank one only department okay okay department name is required and also their employee name is required so we want a n b n and also let's call it some table with C T as okay from C T E we will filter for what where rank equal to one we will select only A N uh, what is the first we need to start with B N B N as department comma A N as uh, employee comma salary salary as capital salary let's run it okay our solution got accepted let's submit it okay we have successfully solved the question thanks for watching my video if you want more detailed explanations like this please subscribe to my channel and share it with your friends or colleagues who is preparing for data analyst or data scientist interview just be disciplined try to complete all the 230 questions one day will achieve your dream job thank you very much mlu prasa signing off